hello guys welcome back to this channel today i will show you this amazing iphone unlocker called unlock go and it's from a company called i2 lab so this is an all-in-one iphone lock removal tool for your iphone ipad or ipod touch if you still have any and this software is available for both windows and mac now today in this video i will show you how to remove icloud activation lock without the previous owner's apple id so there are a lot of scenarios you might face like uh, your iphone was set up with an apple id and you don't have the id or passcode your iphone is disabled it might have been reset and you are asked to input the original apple id that was used for setup so when you get a second hand device the issue is quite common actually without the original owner's apple id or passcode you are icloud active activation locked so by using unlock go you can remove icloud activation lock and start using all the features just like a new branded phone and the most important thing is this is compatible with ios 16.3 ios 15 or even lower android versions and obviously it will be compatible with newer versions of ios millions of people already use the software and you can actually try the software free of cost before you pay anything now let me show you how to use the software first download it using the link I am dropping in the description of this video so now let me show you how to use unlock go to unlock your iCloud activation lock there are a few things you should remember that uh, your iOS device will jailbreak and uh, the software will help you to do so Next important thing is only one iOS device should be connected and the device should have enough power for the whole process to complete. So in this window I will connect my iPhone to the computer. Then make sure you select trust this computer and put your passcode. So it's all set. Now we can start the process. So click on start. Here are some procedure you need to follow on your iPhone model. If you have iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, which I have right now, the procedure is written here. If you have iPhone 8 or later, the process is slightly different. And for other devices, you have the instructions. So for iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, I need to press and hold both the side and volume down button simultaneously for 5 seconds then release the side button but keep holding the volume down button for 10 seconds the screen should remain black if you have successfully entered the DFU mode so let me try it on my phone I am pressing the side button and the volume down button simultaneously and uh, the screen goes off now I release the side button but keep holding the volume down button and the screen is still black so my iPhone 7 has gone into the DFU mode and on the software as you can see the iCloud activation lock removal has started make sure you do not use the phone or disconnect as you can see uh, on the iphone the process is going on so there you go it is successful as showing on the unlock go software simply input your touch id or the passcode and your iphone will be without any icloud activation lock now there are some warnings you should be aware of First of all, do not erase all content or settings or restore your device after removal or the device will be locked again. Number two is do not sign in to your iCloud account for settings. And lastly, after the device equipped with A11 or A10 chip is successfully removed, the screen lock passcode cannot be set. Otherwise, the device will enter DFU mode and you need to exit DFU mode and remove the activation lock again so this is how the software works there are a lot of other features this software offers like you can unlock your screen passcode or unlock your apple id you can turn off fmi that is disable find my iphone or ipad 
also unlock screen time passcode that is remove any restrictions and also bypass mdm that is mobile data management so definitely try this software the link is in the description of this video unlock go is definitely the all-in-one iphone lock removal tool you need if you are an apple user so after trying the software free of cost here is the pricing you have to pay for the full version you get one year plan at just fifty dollars and for one month plan you have to pay just forty dollars but i would suggest you to go for the lifetime plan at just sixty dollars all of these are for five devices and one mac you can get further $10 discount. The link is in the description of this video. So that's all in this video guys. Thanks a lot for watching.